In the NBA, there's always a time period of evaluating who won the trade between the New York Knicks and the Raptors or any other team. Did we do the right thing by getting R.J. Barrett and Emmanuel Quickly? Zach Lowe was doing his podcast and he said word around the league is that the Knicks were able to unload a toxic asset in Barrett. I've always said if there's a continuum of R.J. Barrett optimism or pessimism and over here the pessimistic side is like he just stinks he's a toxic asset and that is a word that got thrown around yesterday in my conversations with front office people and coaches alike Barrett is under the Raptors control for another four years 107 million dollars The Raptors are optimistic that coming home to Toronto could help him tap into his potential as the third pick in 2019 NBA draft. Barrett, however, hasn't quite lived up to the hype just yet, which has become a source of frustration for some Knicks fans during his tenure as a Knick. Barrett averaged 18 points and 5.1 rebounds on 42% field goal shooting. The fact that your front office and your coaches said that, okay, he hasn't performed as advertised, but toxic? That's a little harsh.